Women's Cause was founded four years ago to help families who are facing childhood cancer. Joining me this morning is Megan and Canby Arthur. Great to have you lovely ladies Thanks here. Thanks for having us. Absolutely. Well, such a great thing to talk about, too. Let's just, you know, for people that um, maybe have not heard of, of Cameron's Cause, we've had Trina, his mother, on before mm -hmm. because you guys do things throughout the year. And you've got an event coming up that we're going to get to. But let's just give people just a brief overview of who Cameron was. So, um, Cameron is my nephew. Um, he was diagnosed at 15 with non-Hodgkin's lymphoma. Cameron was a Trojan football player, mm -hmm. but he's, um, he's a, a good hometown boy. He, uh, um, From the area, he actually he, played yes, football at Gordon Lee. He did, he played yes. football for Gordon Lee. Um, if he wasn't on the football field, he was in the woods, right. you know, fishing, hunting. Just right. a, Loved life. He did, bigger than life. Um, if Cameron knew somebody needed something, he was going to bend over backwards to get it. Right. Um, he and had a big heart, so right. uh, we, we try to keep his spirit going. Absolutely, and he did pass away about four years ago, and I think we were taking um, a look at some photos there of Cameron, but this was so important, and I admire your family so much. As I mentioned, we've had his mother on before. Um, you know, just talking about, this is really what it's about. When you go through a tragedy like that, though, if you can overcome it and you can find the strength to help others, and mm -hmm. I just really admire all of your efforts, and you do have an event coming up we that do. we want to talk about. Uh, first, it's a toy drive. It's kind of mm -hmm. a two-part thing, but there's a toy drive, mm -hmm. number one. So tell us about that. So um, Sunday, starting at noon at Gordon Lee um, High School in the uh, um, the new pull-in, uh -huh. um, the horseshoe, sorry. Right. Um, we're going to start off with a motorcycle drive. All right. I love that. I love that it's taking place at Gordon Lee, where yes. Cameron actually went and played. Always it's football a season. Yes, well, so. it's football season, so that's great. Um, uh, if you have a bike and you want to come out, bring a, um, a gently used or a new toy, um, line up with us, and then we're going to um, start at Gordon Lee and drive all the way to Walmart, where Cameron's Calls is going to be there till four, um, collecting toys. For so yeah, and you want the good, and I always used to do this. I, we chatted off. We always chatted off camera. I used to make my kids before Christmas kind of go through and find things that they maybe were not playing with. But you do want nice items yes. that are just, you know, lightly used. Mm -hmm. But you can bring your, your toys there. And this pretty girl next to you can be your daughter. You're sitting awfully quietly. But I want to just ask you, why was it important for you to be here today and, and kind of help with things like the toy drive? Um, Cameron was one of my most favorite cousins. He was actually one of the best because, like, my other cousins, they would always be mean to me, and he would always be <laughs> over there just telling me that it was okay. Right. I'll get through it. Right. And um, he's always wanted to give back to others. Like, say he had extra, like, food, he would go and give it to kids at school mm -hmm. that didn't have food. Right. Well, I can tell when both of you talk about him and with his mother, too. I mean, I can see it in your eyes, just how special he was. We'd look at those photos, and it was such a, a tragedy. But, you, again, you are taking that tragedy, and you're really doing something good. You help families throughout the year as well. You partner up with T.C. Thompson mm -hmm. if families, you know, because it's so financially draining. It's such a struggle. So, you, But you do partner with them, mm -hmm. and they actually contact you throughout the year yes. if families have needs. Is that right? Yes, ma'am. Um, if a family needs um, a gas card to get their kid to treatment or... Right. You know, um, a lot of these kids are hospitalized every two weeks, right. and they they spend a week at a time in the hospital for treatment. Yeah. Um, and I know that, like, you know, if your kid's in the hospital, you can't leave. So we, we take, you know, snack baskets or um, Chick-fil-A cards, right. anything that we can possibly do. Cause it's, it, because it is the little things, and mm -hmm. having walked this journey and been through that, I mean, you can empathize with these families yes. better than anyone. So I really appreciate what you guys do. And, again, if you want to take part, you know, there's a two-part. There's a, First, there's a motorcycle run, or there is a toy drive taking place at the Fort Oglethorpe in Walmart. They're mm -hmm. going to be out there at the toy drive from 12 to 4 that day. And you can find out more information on Facebook, right? Yes. There's a Cameron Calls 39 yes. at Facebook right there to get more information. Ladies, thank you so much thank for just being here again. and for all of your hard work in honoring Cameron. Thanks so much, and we'll be right back.